So Carvis, do you feel pressure at being now replacing David Allen effectively on stage? No, curiously not. Um, and I don't mean that in any kind of um, arrogant way, so much as it's almost as if the, the person that you are on stage, whoever that guy is, it's very much that guy. And I think when we did the first gig, I was so terrified um, before the first gig we did in France. Uh, I was really, really terrified until the point that we walked on stage and then it's, it's almost as soon as the step on the stage, that fucking guy mm. gave me a high five and gave, took the guitar and took over. And I, mm. I don't think I would like that guy in real life. And often it's the weird thing is after a gig, sort of go to a hotel and think, you know, in bed thinking back to a gig and think, oh God, I was being such a prick, but it, it's that guy was being such a prick, but he seems to... He seems to do the job, and so whatever I was, however worried I was about replacing David, that guy that take, takes over as soon as I walk, walk on and takes the guitar and does it, doesn't seem to have any problems. Yeah, I guess they just be it's themselves, and which is kind of how it's always been since I've been in Gong, which is six years. Ago. And it was never about replacing anybody; it was about just being yourself, and they kind of you know, accepted that, and wanted you to contribute to Sean. Someone came up with it, it was probably David or Steve Finch about Gong being a boat and uh, like a vessel, you know. And whoever is in the band is sailing the vessel, and then people get off and other people get off and travels down the river or wherever it's going. <laughs> it's not just, you know, it's not just these five blokes, you know, it's just like there's these shadows and all these other emotions behind us with their hands on our shoulders, so conscious and unconscious. So the, the new album will be part of that, can't you? In some way, or whatever, or whatever. Some way, it's it's going to be fucking amazing. It's all <laughs> <laughs> <more> fucking rad. <laughs> Nice to to play, be playing Gong stuff on tour, and then start writing. Mm. Having played that, to have at least get, then got into the Gong mindset. You know, having played this stuff, both with David and since David passing, I, I, you know, having having sort of felt how it operates and got got a sense of the, you know, the way it, the way it moves and the way it works, and also having listened to it for so long, I think it will be. There's no way it won't sound gongish, whatever. <laughs> 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 